something to keep an eye on tonight with Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum, guys. Mega, thank you. Tonight's starting lineups, they're presented by Popeyes. And the Boston Celtics win the opening tip. I know the Wizards and the Scouts saw the game as well. You cannot go under on Derek White or anybody when it comes to guard and pick and roll scenarios past the three-point line. For tonight's game has been set at 2.31. You look at Alex Sar, 7-1, Bilal, 6-8, Kuz, 6-9, 6-10. Bub Carrington, the rookie, is 6-5, and Jordan Cruz, 6-4, as he takes the basketball away from Al Horford. Here's Tatum on a step-back jumper. As Alex Sar skies for the rebound. Oh, nice. Ooh, with a crossover in transition, high off the window. Multiple rotations defensively, and they're going to be shooting threes. Deep seal, good deflection there by Poole. Bali driving right, getting past Brown. Talk about can you coexist with Tatum? I think they. I think that's over with. Yeah, that is over with. <laughs> They've proven that. The question now is how many championships can you win together? The question now is who's gonna be the third guy? Fifty-four percent from three. Great defensive possession right there, and that's what I want to see. Can Alex Sar guard one through five? Pool. Can he hit another three? Yes, sir. Jordan Poole starting the game. One-on-one, -on -one D. When you're on Lonely Island tonight with Tatum and Brown primarily, you cannot ask for help. Oh, Jordan Poole indeed is getting a pool party activated here in the first quarter. Dude, with that tough of a struggle to get a bucket. That stops a 12-0 Wizards run as he turns four threes from distance. Tatum getting touched up by Coos. Here's Wizards in transition. Kisper putting it on the deck over to Poole in the corner. He continues to shoot. Actually win it. Here's Poole trying to close out the first quarter the way he started it. That'll do it for the first 12 of the regular season debut of the Washington Wizards as they trailed the Celtics 33-32. Yeah, that was too slow for me. <laughs> I'll be honest. Hey, the jump that hook, year, I was like, that stuff was hey, too old. Jump hook was crazy though, both hands. But that season I watched Endo and scores. Jalen Brown with seven. It's a little too easy right there. I like to see Cool slide his feet, game position, maybe take a charge. Oh, ah, Marvin Bag. Cool crossover, stops, pops, mm -hmm. and hits. You can tell who's been in the gym this summer, Chris. Trigger. Tough fadeaway shot by Kuzma. At Jordan Poole with a free safety. 17.6 rebounds for Jason Tatum. Deep three goes up to Poole. Kuz on the run. Deep three. Deep three. Rebounded by White. Derek White also 14 points along with. I'll be on the beach watching. <laughs> Wide open, Cal Kuzma. Good two-man game between the two vets. Sar with a handoff to Poole. Good floater there by Jordan. Gives him 22 on the night. Celtics now 10 of 24 from three. Shooting 42%. Bub in the mid-range. Who's picking up the dribble. Oh, Celtics switching on defense. Brown one on one here with Poole. Brown count the bucket and the foul. Jalen Brown using that 6'6", 220 frame. He's played on his birthday twice before. Scored 23 against the Knicks in 2017. And his third career 20 point game against the Bulls in 2022. He had 21. Here he is now with the basketball. Started this quarter outscoring the Wizards 14 to 4. Pool. Last game of the regular season last season. But Peyton Pritchard against the Wizards had a career high 38 and 12 assists. Light work, easy work right there for JV. Drew Holiday to help off that strong side corner. Xavier Tillman turns it over. Palau upstairs. George! His five points. He's got a steal. No good on that three for Tatum. No good on that three for Tatum. 
JP keeping that dribble, getting inside the paint, shooting over Luke Cornett. Missed alley -oop. opportunity for the Celtics. With five minutes before halftime, the Wizards led by two, 51-40. Brown on the backboards for his seventh. Kyle Kuzma getting into that passing lane, which leads to a turnover. Cool. And he was fouled by Kata. Has eight points in that first half. But the issue, and I, I'll ask the question back to you with a different one. The issue is the margin of error. When you go up against a team yes. like Boston, going under screen yeah. with this yeah. team is a huge mistake. D doubling, double, teaming double teaming is a huge mistake. Which was huge, I believe, in this second half for the Wizards, the inability of valuing the possession of the ball. And again, Drew, Tuesday night. I don't care if it was a cap crunch. Alan Junis following up the full miss. Celtics are matching their largest lead until Kyle Kuzma gets the layup. This game belongs to the world champion Boston Celtics as they come into Capital One Arena and take care of business, led by their dynamic duo of Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown. Brown with 27, Tatum with 25. They got contributions from Derek White.